uh, 65-7 uh, here next. Um, uh, louder marked one, uh, Pedigree on the 65s. Uh, uh, dugout back on an unashamed uh, dugout, uh, the GNS bred boar there, sired by Major League that uh, uh, we own with uh, GNS and and Rosebird there, our good buddies uh, uh, north of here. Uh, a bit of good partnership uh, on that boar. He's done a nice job, and uh, the the sow would be a first litter unashamed. Uh, uh, her litter mate brother uh, would have been a class winner at Denver, and then champion light cross at uh, San Angelo. So uh, back by a good South family, and uh, we've seen a couple of those 65s now, and uh, I think they've got a real shot, bring some extra stoutness. Uh, they're out on the corners, yet uh, uh, they're proportional and good built. Stout, dense one, and uh, it hits me as one of the greener ones so far out of that particular litter. Uh, it looks like one, again, soundness-wise and flexibility and everything, looks like one you can you can feed right along into the fall and, and kind of be where you need to be. Again, he's a... He's a, a boxier, more moderate, uh, stouter, denser kind of a pig, but still rolled at the right pace on through the fall. Could be a pretty good size hog and still have everything he needs to be in, uh, to be a three dimensionally stout one, uh, with a, you know with a good kind of look. But but the, the indicators, you know, the, the, the skull, the bone, angles, uh, rib, hip, all that stuff. I mean, he's, it's in there, and you can see it. Um, you feed it at the right pace, and again, maximize everything you can out of that one over a, a long, slow roll, and that would be a nice, nice bear to, to feed on. That's 65-7. Uh,